Tens of thousands of cell phones are working again after an AT&T outage today. Some people had no signal for hours and couldn't text, couldn't call. Yeah, this really uh, caught a lot of people off guard and stopped them in their tracks when they realized they couldn't communicate with anybody today. Yeah. Fox News multimedia reporter Kennedy Hayes is live in Denver. So, Kennedy, who did this affect? Well, Mark and Christina, it hit AT&T users across the country. Verizon and AT&T say their, excuse me, Verizon and T-Mobile say their networks were not impacted, but some of their customers had issues texting or calling AT&T phones. Now, no word yet on what caused this, but a defense official tells us that they have no indication this was a cyber attack. And in the most recent statement for, from AT&T, a spokesperson said, quote, we have restored wireless service to all our affected customers. We we sincerely apologize to them and keeping our customers connected remains our top priority and we are taking steps to ensure our customers do not experience this again in the future. According to outage tracker down detector, customers in at least nine major cities reported AT&T outages this morning, including Los Angeles, Dallas, Chicago, Atlanta and Miami. The problem started popping up around 3.30 ET and I spoke to a cybersecurity expert about how tech companies investigate these issues. There's so many things that can cause a problem like this, whether it's a hardware issue or, you know, something with, you know, changing software or making some kind of update. When you think of something as critical to daily life and life safety as the cellular networks and systems, you know, you can certainly be sure that people are working very hard on this. Down Detector says at the height of the outages around 11 a.m., there were about 74,000 outages. And most phone users had issues with texting and calling on their mobile phones, but some also had trouble with their home phones and Internet. Now, even if your cell phone network goes down, you may be able to make calls on your Wi-Fi. You would find more about that in your phone's settings. In Denver, Kennedy Hayes, Fox 10 News.